holy snowfall, Batman. What is up, everybody? It is uh, March 28th, 2022, and we are getting some pretty good snow. I am so happy right now. Like this is this is this is the snowfall that I've been waiting for, and it it, it hasn't seemed to uh, to ever want to really make its mark this season. So it's not going to be much, but it's really coming down hard. And uh, yeah, so I get to make another video. See you guys again. And, Get your comments. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys. And thank you guys for being so supportive of everything that I go through. Oh my gosh. I feel like a teenage girl with you guys sometimes. There's nothing wrong with a teenager. Just saying, that's how I behave sometimes. Wow. So we're gonna go into Upper Moon Ridge. Um, why am I forgetting their name? One of you guys wanted me to, to go up into Upper Moon Ridge off of Villa Grove. Look at how heavy it's snowing right now. Oh my gosh. It's, uh, it's, it makes me so happy. It's almost... I don't know, man. It's it, it makes me too happy. Like that's just it's not good. Like it, it's like a like an af, an aphrodisiac for me. Like I hope there's no wild animals walking around. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh my god, sorry. <laughs> I'm in a I'm in a really strange mood right now. So yeah. But look at all this damn snow. This is insane. This person will not stop texting me. It's not who I want to text me. Just put it that way. But I don't give up too easy. Anyway, we'll get more into that some other time. But <laughs> I am so excited about this. I can't believe this is happening. And I don't know why I decided to go up this way to Villa Grove, but that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take sheep horn. Wow, it's really coming down. This is this is unbelievably beautiful. My heart needed this. <laughs> Seriously. Seriously, I, I put myself through so much, you guys. i I screw up everything in my life. I screw up everything in my life. I, I just, I, I just, I don't know what the hell is wrong with me. I mean, I have nothing but so much love to give. And it's just, it's just, it's just, it's just crazy what it, the things I do to myself. The sabotage, self-sabotage, it's just unbelievable. I don't know if it's because I'm afraid of being hurt, and so I am the one who does something to hurt. I just don't. I just don't know. I just. I, I've, I've, I've got to figure it out. It's one of those crazy things, man. It's one of those crazy things. Oh, where am I going? Yeah. I can hardly see it. This is so awesome. Oh my gosh, like finally. I wish you guys were up here with me right now. Just cruising around with me. Chilling like villains. How are you all doing? Are you guys doing okay? Is everything all right with you guys right now? All you guys staying healthy? What's going on? Talk to me. Let me know. I want to make sure each and every single one of you are okay. You guys know I will, I will fight for you guys. You guys have done so much for me. You guys have, have made me feel so amazing. 
I would always fight for you guys. Whatever you guys needed, I would do the best that I could. I, I really would do the best that I could. The longer that I've had you guys in my life, the deeper that gets. And it's pretty amazing. You guys have just been unconditional love. And I'm so grateful for you guys. Like, I, I wish I could marry you guys. Like, just, just marry the YouTube channel. <laughs> Seriously. That would be great. That would be wonderful. But no, I have to deal with being my dumbass self sometimes. Saying the stupidest things. I mean, seriously, the stupidest things. I like, like, I'll eventually tell you guys what happened and why I, like, why I've really, you know, just, I don't know. Like, I really hope I get another chance. I really do. But I really screwed up. I really, really, really screwed up so bad. Oh my God, what an idiot. And this is somebody who didn't need any more pain in her life. Like, like I just wanted to be there and take it all away from her. <laughs> and then I go and do that shit. Stuff, sorry. Okay, uh, where, oh yeah, we're going to right, yeah, okay. So, yeah, I made a really stupid comment. I tell you guys everything, so those of you who are still watching, I will I will tell you what happened. So we're we're just having a great conversation, laughing, 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 laughing. I don't think I need to say who, who this is. It's obvious who I'm talking about, that female. Um and uh you know we're just laughing, 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 and like I'm I'm just loving these conversations because we're just laughing, laughing, laughing. And then like like in the heat of the moment it's like I don't know what came over me look she had her first kid at 16 years old and she's my age she's 42 and so her daughter is in her late 20s and her daughter has two kids so she's she's a she's a grandma and we're the same age it just trips me out um, and I made a joke like uh, like we should all three get together like oh my god what like Like, who does that? Like, who does that? Dude, like, I have been beating myself up so bad. Like, I, 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 I don't know where that came from. I would never, I've never even thought about that. I would never even think about that. Like, I'm, I'm such a good guy that, like, going out with whomever I'm with, I don't ever even look at another woman. Like, and I said something so stupid I can't believe I said that like and now she she like says like like it's just she always thinks about it always thinks about it and she's she's probably gonna have a hard time with me around her daughter and like I had never even met her daughter at that point like, like I was just being a guy and I thought she would she might get a kick out of it like like there was no seriousness to it it was it was like such such a joke and we were just laughing our asses off like can't breathe laughing so hard together like it was just so beautiful and then I go ahead and do that so um, yeah I'm a total tool just a total tool self saboteur deluxe oh, man like there's a lot of words that I can't say on this channel that I am and that I behave like it's just sorry for pointing the thing at me for so long. Holy crap! S surprised this camera didn't break after looking at me for that long. <laughs> All right, so where am I? Um, but yeah, so guys, I said something really, 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 really stupid, and uh, yeah, like I mean, I hear that like she, like all she thinks about all day is me from the point she wakes up and. And like, just like, she's so happy with all the amazing things. And then she starts to think about that comment and then it pisses her off so bad. And she's just confused. She doesn't know what to do. Like, like dude, like, oh my God, I will go to the end of the earth for this lady. I really will. I will do whatever it takes to make it up to her. Anything, I will do anything, absolutely anything. I'm not a desperate man. Like. Like I, 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 I am desperately an idiot driving though. Let's see here. And 
So the fact that I blew something, I don't think it's totally blown because, you know, I am a charming ass guy and I really do care for her. But no matter what, like, and this is the first woman who I've ever felt like this about, where like, if I can't have her now, I still want her to be happy. I don't want, like, like, I, like I'm not gonna be a jerk about it. Like, I really want this girl to be happy. And I want her to succeed and, 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 and do what makes her comfortable. And I know that comment that I made was just horrifying. I mean, it really couldn't, it couldn't have gotten any worse, you guys. Like, that, that was, that was Mount Everest of stupid things I could have said. That was the, that was the summit. I mean, I skipped thousands and thousands of feet and just went straight for the summit. I didn't go to base camp. I didn't, I didn't do nothing. <laughs> I went straight to the summit with that. Where am I going? You know, I'm going to get stuck up here because I'm not going to be able to, like, I'm going to get stuck on a really steep street somewhere. I have no idea where I'm driving. I'm just driving, talking to you guys because I love you guys. And I know you guys want to know what's going on in my life. So the people who are still listening, like, like, you guys are the ones, man. You guys are the ones. But, yeah. I hope a lot of you watch this one so you can uh, see what I'm going through. And I am human. I have a lot of feelings. Man, what street is this? I have no idea. But yeah, so I... Yeah, I really put... A big obstacle in the way of literally like the woman of my dreams <laughs> like and she she'd be mine now if I wasn't such an idiot like that's the hardest part is that like when when you screwed up yourself and uh, yeah so that's what I'm going through right now sucks pretty bad but i'm really happy for the snow so that's 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 really good but yeah it, it sucks really really bad she's just such a lovely gal she's so amazing smart she graduated college um she was she, she was a nurse for for many years and yeah she's she's very 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 intelligent she has a great job she makes good money like she's just she's she's something special something special and I made the stupidest comment that anybody could ever ever make I, like what was I thinking like what was I thinking so but I I don't give up I don't give up especially like dude there's there's something different here like like there's some like this is there's something different that I've never ever felt in my whole life even with girls that I was engaged to so it's it's just like a like a good friendship too and we'll become a much better friendship and that's what I want like but she's super smoking hot um just absolutely stunning you guys like seriously like but I think it's a compliment when other guys look look at my girls or in this case my girl <laughs> I wish I'm such an idiot seriously I'm such an idiot I really hope some of you learn from me but I know none of you are stupid enough to say what I said I mean who does that just the king of the douches douchebaggery 101 come to me I will teach you how to be just just the total douche have everything in your hands and then throw it all away as I said I, I, I want her to be I want her to be happy like it's, it's, it's crazy because I really 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 like her but if she doesn't choose you know she has as much time in the world as she needs because Big Bear's a small place, so I'm I'm happy to wait and I've been waiting for a long time for like someone like this. So it's pretty amazing. Pretty amazing.
but anyway, thanks for listening, you guys. That's my that's my sob story for the evening. And uh, I just wish her a very, very beautiful evening, full of peace and joy, and no douchebags. <laughs> so I probably won't be involved in the night. But anyway. But I feel, I feel maybe sharing some of my pain like could help somebody. It's not easy talking about this, you guys. Like it's, it's, it's really not, but I understand what I did and I take complete responsibility for it. And it's, there's, I mean, I'm not gonna give up. I'm not gonna give up on her. And no, people, I'm not like a stalker. I'm just saying that I'm not gonna give up on, on just, treating her how she deserves to be treated and respecting her um yeah anyway sorry baby I didn't mean to ever hurt you I would do anything to take it back anything but let's get back to the weather I'm way off track here okay so we're on Moon Ridge right now and it's still snowing pretty good over here. I'm contemplating where we're gonna go next. <coughs> oh my gosh, will you stop texting me? Jeez. like tonight I won't take any side streets in case some of you are considering and contemplating getting your buns up here get your arses up here and enjoy this last little well you know what like keep in mind you guys every year that I've lived here I've I've recorded snow I've recorded snow in uh, in May every year so uh, we still have time it's just the ski resorts close in a week or so so any Real formal winter activities will be over in about a week. Look at Big Bear Boulevard. This is awesome. This is so beautiful. Wellesley, thank you. Hey, watch out guys, there's an idiot passing by. That would be me, total tool. Dynamite would be like, what idiot? <laughs> Gosh. I love having these videos. 
videos on, on record because it really feels like for some reason you guys are here with me and I'm talking to you guys in person. It's, it's, it's a really interesting feeling and I've, I've really enjoyed it for so many years. I love you guys, man. absolutely beautiful. I am so happy right now. This makes me so happy. It's, it's just, I, I, I can't explain like what it is about this type of weather that does this to me. But it really, it just really brings out as much joy as possible. This sight never gets old for me. It never gets old for me. So I know it gets a bit redundant with what I do, but this is this is you know it, it makes me happy. I know it's kind of lame, but it makes me happy. It's just so dead up here right now. It's 10 p.m. There's not a car on the road in the village. Oh yeah, because it's snowing, it's probably why. But for me, this is just normal. Like, I drive out in the snow more than I do in dry weather. That's not quite true, but you guys get what I'm trying to say. Seriously, you guys, you guys mean an awful lot to me. Thank you for always being there for me and just giving me so much love. You guys give me so much love. I really, really, really do love you guys. I care about you guys so much. I truly want always the best for all of you. And I tell you guys this all the time because I really want you guys to know how special you are and what you've done for me. The impact on my existence has been at magnitudes that I can't even contemplate. You guys have done so much for me. And I am so thankful. I love you guys. I love you, I love you, I love you. I kind of hate myself right now, but... Sorry, I hope I didn't say that too loud. I thought I didn't say it, but then I heard it and realized that I did say it. So I hope I didn't say the F word too loud. Because I will not offend any women or children, no matter how I'm feeling. Well, I'll make stupid comments that will definitely offend them. But uh, I learned my lesson. I learned my lesson. I, just, I hope you guys understand that I would never, ever, 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 ever do anything to intentionally hurt somebody like that. Ever. Like, as I said, we were having the just best laughs together. And, um, like, it, it, was, it was just, it was perfect. It really was. It was perfect. And then there goes my mouth. Bing! <laughs> See ya! <laughs> Seriously. What in income poop? Oh, you 
you're going to take one or two lanes. Actually, have them both. I'm in no hurry. I ain't got no one to go visit. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, I really hope a lot of you get to watch this and, and, and see a little bit of of more of my suffering and struggles. Because I, you know, if I can open up about it, then maybe some of you who are struggling with with talking about these things will be able to to open up to someone that you really love to get it out. Because it's really important that you guys get these things out. You don't want to hold these things in; they will manifest into some serious negativity. So you want to talk to people. I've, I've talked to, I've talked to quite a few people since, uh, yeah, just since all this crap happened. And, uh, yeah, I've had a lot of support, a lot of good advice. And the cool thing is, is that most of the advice was pretty much the same thing. So I'm happy with that. Just saying, you know what? Just give her time. Just give her time. They're telling me, like, I guess probably trying to boost my ego. Like, you're so wonderful, dude. Like, you're you're a handsome guy. Like, 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 dude. Just, just give her time. Just give her time. You know. So, I just want to give her whatever she wants. If she doesn't want me, then, then I, then I don't want to pursue her like that. But I'm not gonna give up until she, like, throws a just, you know, says no, or, or we end up living an amazing life as partners, because there's a lot that I still want to do, a lot, this guy, come on, Jeez, my sway bar is going to break again, I am not happy. It's, it's doing the, the exact same stuff that it was doing. The last three times that it snapped. I really don't want any sway bars to snap again. I was worried it might happen during the storm. So I'm taking every turn really slowly and just making sure that I don't sway too much. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh man. So, I'll leave you guys with this. If you screw something up and you really, really know that you made a mistake and you really want to try to fix that problem, then listen. Listen. Because in the heat of the moment, the emotions are tumbling and and you're thinking about yourself and oh my god like this person's not going to be in my life or this or that oh my god oh my gosh and uh yeah just uh instead of doing that just listen to what they have to say and talk about it to people who you trust people who you love people who you know wouldn't feed you any bs and on that one i just want to say i love you guys a lot once again and uh I'm gonna miss you guys, but I'll be doing another video in a little bit, so it's all good.